before this video starts, I just want to say I did not come up with any of these strats. I'm just compiling the information that like I've noticed over time, and I realized that it could be hard for people to understand this. So I just want to make like a quick video on how it works and how to do it. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for watching. All right, guys. Today we're going to be looking at something called pirate strats in uh, 1.14/1.16 speedruns, which involves uh. Wait, that's the world name. Which involves basically, instead of like looting a village, you loot a shipwreck and the treasure, and sometimes an ocean monument. So that's pretty nice. Uh, I gen I gen this seed earlier, and I just can't fucking cancel it. Pretty world. So this is the seed I'm using. I just gen this like a couple minutes ago. It's a good island seed with a shipwreck nearby and an ocean monument, so it's a great example for this. And yeah, we spawned on this island. This is just it just doesn't look good. Like this spawn just looks awful, right? You got an island. Normally, like, like I think like a week ago, I would reset this. Just so you reset this. But now, what I would do? Let's just go into creative. I would get. I would get three logs. One, two, three. Let's say I got three logs, and then I get a crafting table. And a stick, crafting table, sticks, and an axe. So I'd have an axe. I'd break more wood. Blah 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 blah. blah. And then I would make a boat and I would head over to uh, this shipwreck. Now in the shipwreck, I would loot the chest, the main chest, which is in here. And it really depends what kind of shipwreck you get. Normally you get like one that doesn't have this back part. And sometimes you do. This one's the perfect one. It's not the perfect one. You miss one chest, but this is like the one you need. You need this chest right here, which, which is, has all the iron and like valuables. And this chest right here, which has the uh, treasure map. Now on the treasure map. Now something I did not mention in the video was that there are three chests of chests. There is the uh, valuable chest, which is in the back of the ship. Then there is the um, the treasure map chest, which is normally right here through this door. And then there's a food chest, which is under like trap doors. And this okay, this is a horrible example. This has no food, but like I guess it has some food. But like normally there could be like stuff like this. Carrots are like the main food you want. Carrots and wheat. That's like the good stuff. Because you can make bread and golden carrots one in another. And yeah. Sometimes a problem with the strat is you do not have enough food. Which is I think the only problem with the strat. And that the fact that it's a little bit slower. But sometimes you get a lot of gold. And yeah that's all I want to preface. So hope you guys keep enjoying the video. I'm going to mark it. It's going to be. So right now I'm going to go southeast to find it. And I'm just going to start going right now. Which is this way. I already looked at this. Oh, that's useful. I should just do that more often. So we're going to fly southeast. And I guess normally you're just like on a boat and stuff. And we're going to keep going until we find this map. So now it starts loading in, which means I'm close. And my I'm going way too far east. So let's just start going more south. And it looks like this is the island. So now we're here. And once we're at the island, we're going to open our coordinates, right? We're right on top of the X, as you can see. Oh, okay. Now, like, we're around on top of the X. We're most likely in the same chunk as the X. And what you're going to do is you're going to look at your chunk. You're going to want to see... So this is 917. This is... You want to see 9 and 9. So, oh, right here. See how that's 99. Nine. And you're just going to dig straight down. And boom. Chest every single time. It always wants at 99. Nine. This has a lot of gold, lots of food, lots of TNT. And... Now you're going to want to look for an underwater ravine normally, because, I mean, it's probably going to be an ocean world. You're not going to find a regular lava pool. You want to look for an underwater ravine. You're also going to want to craft doors and fence gates. I don't know what the fence gates are for. I see people crafting this. Maybe I'll, like, do, like, a side note, like, edit this in. I don't know. I need to go watch some people's videos on how they made this. So I've watched some Twitch videos now, and um, I got some good information. I found, this is from The Sizzler, you guys probably know of him. You're going to want to find an underwater ravine, and look for, make sure it's the one with like obsidian and magma, and you're going to look for like a formation like this. It has, it's going to look like one, two, three, it's going to look like that. And make sure it's a magma, so you can actually access it. So I'm actually going to go into survival to show this off better. You're going to, I didn't get myself doors. Well, you want doors. You want doors. Oak. Door. Only need one. You're going to mine this block out. It's going to be obsidian. And you're going to place a door here. Then you're going to place a block in front of you. And break the magma below you. So you have access to lava. Now you're going to want to place a block there. And a block there. And then you're going to jump up. Go here behind. And place two blocks. One up top of this obsidian. And two up here. Behind it. So 
So then you can uh, place more, more um, you also, okay, you can either place one here, here, preferably the one away from you. So you can uh, go like that. Then you're gonna want to uh, place a block there and break this. So now you're chilling. And just now you have an open area like this. Make sure you remove lava from that slot. So there isn't lava there anymore. You're gonna take your water and place it on the side. And now you're gonna, now you have like basically almost it. Just like place your water like, I don't know, there. Make sure that's a lava source block and you have a portal slash give an emerald flint and a scoring steel. And it works. That's the strat. And yeah, hopefully you guys can use this a little faster. It's definitely better than digging to the wall because it's quite slow actually. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, thanks for watching.